hi everyone welcome to this video and in this video we are going to learn on how to set up the chaos toolkit so before getting started in the video we will learn what is chaos toolkit and what is chaos engineering see with the advent of microservices environment companies like netflix is more interested to conduct an assessment of the environment the platform that we which we run through controlled experiments to find out weaknesses in your particular environment or in your application. So chaos engineering is basically, it came from Netflix and they started chaos monkey and chaos toolkit, which went mainstream. And today, most of the companies are actually using chaos engineering in, in, their, in their work environments. So to get started chaos toolkit, it's a free open source project that actually enables you to create and apply chaos experiments to determine and eventually to improve and address weaknesses across your system infrastructure your platform and your application so even if you're running an nginx web server you can write your experiments to target only nginx not the any other component or if you want to run a particular experiment targeting uh internet uh, information service uh, iis you can do that so it gives you the ability to target your application your system infrastructure as well as your platform on which you are trying to run so chaos monkey is one of the tools that uh, netflix um, open sourced it so in that basically we can run these chaos experiments on aws you can shut down a couple of nodes in aws to verify what is going to be the impact on this there is a hypothesis that they create using these type of uh, self-sustained uh, experiments so let's get started with installing the chaos toolkit cli which is called as chaos it's a python program that is executed in your terminal so you need to have a windows i'm um, sorry you need to have a linux server it exposes various built-in commands for performing various different tasks so it's since it's a python let's make sure we have python Three, version 3 installed in our system so python 3 you do v which is version yes you have it installed so basically what we're going to do is usually the python binary refines to python 2 so make sure you're using python 3 in your commands as a python program it's best to install its own virtual environment like like container inside uh, that So just a minute. Okay, we are back to the terminal again. So let's just verify Python 3. Okay. We got 3.6.7 and we'll create the virtual environment now. Then VS is the virtual environment that creates it. So once the virtual environment is installed, you need to activate it in the command by giving source command and go to that particular extension and click on activate. So we can see we are inside the uh, chaos toolkit. Chaos toolkit now. So we are going to use pip to manage the dependencies and install chaos toolkit. So let's make sure we have the latest and uh, you know the latest pip installed. So how we can do that is pip install unattended and we are installing pip. So this downloads and successfully installed pip um, 19.0. Uh, so now we are going to install the chaos toolkit. Uh, since it's a uh, Python package, where you're going to use pip install. Same, we're going to do an unattended install. And we are going to do chaos toolkit. So this installs chaos toolkit in our system. So now note that pip may 
complain while installing some dependencies these are the warnings are nothing to worry about and will not prevent those dependencies from being installed now chaos toolkit is successfully installed you can see successfully installed chaos toolkit 1.0.0 so what uh, we can do is we can run chaos help to find out if chaos engineering toolkit has been installed in our system yes we have it so what we are going to do right now is get into the practical uh, session again to understand what is chaos toolkit extensions see these are various extensions that are available on chaos engineering toolkit so which actually helps you to layer and technologies that can be targeted in your experiments so for example if you are running a docker environment and you want to run your chaos experiments against a docker environment you need to install the extension for docker <coughs> the same <coughs> sorry the same thing goes with um, kubernetes extensions also so a chaos toolkit uses various extensions to drive chaos experiments against the multitude of technologies and layers in a typical system the integrations are typically installed in the same python environment that we have created the virtual environment which we create and we we are going to use the chaos commands itself so now you can install kubernetes integration through chaos toolkit extension and we will use the same command called pip pip install chaos toolkit it's kubernetes so this installs the kubernetes chaos engineering uh, toolkit extension which can help us to write experiments and target Kubernetes environments in our platform. Whether you're running it on GKE, you're running it on your on-premises Kubernetes, you can do all those things. So the pip tool, actually what it did right now is it fetched the Chaos Toolkit Kubernetes extension and installed with all the necessary dependencies. Now you can check if uh, this particular extension is properly installed or not. You can use pip freeze and you can grep you can grep chaos toolkit yes we have the chaos toolkit installed we have the chaos toolkit kubernetes the extension which is installed and you have a library which is default so that completes this video on installing the chaos toolkit on a on a linux vm so if you see basically i'm exiting out of uh, the virtual environment which we create so that expired my uh, virtual machine also in the environment so basically we are running an ubuntu uh, vm to do all these tasks and i hope this video helped you to understand what is chaos toolkit a little bit introduction into chaos engineering see uh, trust me like there are a lot of companies which are using chaos engineering right now and chaos engineering and sre uh, system reliability engineering or uh, these two things are hot in the market right now and i hope learning this will help you to understand chaos engineering and various level of experiments that you can run against your platform environment and applications i hope this video is informative if you want to watch more videos like this please do subscribe to the channel i will try to make more videos on cloud security and different latest news and trends and if you want to have any questions that wants to get it answered or you want any consulting work in your environment in your company you can always contact me at Sandeep, S-A-N-D-E-E-P, Serum, S-W-E-R-A-M, at Outlook.com. So I'll try to respond to most of the questions. And um, thank you very much, guys, for watching this video. Stay tuned for more videos like this. And have a wonderful day. See you in the next video. Until then, bye-bye.